guys, welcome back to TGT. I am currently playing Chroma Squad. It's this neat little game I saw on Hot Pepper Gaming. It's kind of like Power Rangers. It's pretty incredible. Um, I have to confess something. I recorded like a whole episode's worth of this before realizing that I couldn't use the footage because the audio I'm using to record the my voice was just too damn low. So we're gonna hit new game. We're gonna choose interesting. And we're gonna get this pony show underway! Once upon a time, at a TV studio just like any other. Since I already know what I'm doing, I'm gonna try and speed through this as fast as I can. This episode is still going to be pretty long. I have no idea why I'm talking this way! Super Rangers, it's time! Wait, no, 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 he's gotta have a, like an angrier voice. Super Rangers, it's time for all stuntmen to get to the day. Oh yeah, that's a, that's gonna be its voice. It's it, you you hate it already. Here we go. Here we go. And where are the minions? See, they're all like putties. See, look at that. Look at that. See, original Power Ranger colors. I really like that, that's pretty rad. And then all these dudes, they're basically putties, right? There we go, we are set for this part, the facts will come later. Alright, you may have heard my chair. I guess we are all lacking some story, huh? Now, I can't give him that voice, it just sounds stupid. I guess we're all lacking some story, huh? Yeah, but Dr. Mia doesn't enjoy it that much. This is getting really boring. I'm kind of tired of... STOP TALKING WHILE WE'RE RECORDING! <laughs> he just like barks all over himself. He's like, ah, someone get me a towel! BATTLE NEVER SHOULD I REMIND YOU! You may click to either choose or monsters or whatever. Defeat three enemies! Alright. Check it out, since I already like know what I'm doing, uh, I'm gonna go over here. Oh shit, I chose the wrong one. Oh well. You may have noticed that. I can't talk. You may have noticed that we, like, don't censor out cursing anymore on TGT. Um, that's pretty much just because Jesse and Dimitri do it all the fucking time, and it, it, it's just like. Having to edit that down, you know, spending, I don't know, like. 20 minutes on a video just because we record long videos because we have no idea what the fuck we're doing. Um, it's not exactly a problem until like they're doing it over and over and over again and it's just like, Jesus Christ. It, it just gets tiring. It's tiring to record and then do that. Like I, that's, that's what I don't like about it. So I'm gonna record this and I'm not gonna censor like really anything out unless I like absolutely need to. Um, such as if I say something I really shouldn't have said. Uh, without me knowing, of course, I'm not just gonna go out and just say awful things just because I feel like- I feel like I'm getting a cold. Like, the, the more- the more I'm just like, ah, talking, talking, the more I'm just like, am I getting a cold? I don't know if I'm getting a cold. Um, anyways. Red's gonna run over here. Shazam! What up? This is pretty cool. Defeat three enemies. This was one of the best episodes so far. Psst. He always says that. As long as we're defeating the monsters really easily. I heard you. Now I want some acrobatics. Now we add some explosions later. Whatever. What kind of... LET ME FINISH TALKING! That was really loud, I'm sorry guys. Jeez. You fat, bald director dude. You should use teamwork maneuvers to toss people around so they can move further. If you still don't get a word I said, hit the teamwork button and blah 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 blah. I'm sorry guys, I've, I've, I've seen this like before. So I'm like, I have to move faster. Okay, we're ready. 
See, I do like this. They all, like, come down from different spots. That's pretty cool. Oh, I am yawning! Ready to! See, I just gotta perform, too, but check it out. What we're gonna do... We're gonna get you... We and then you get to go in front of him. We see the first time. The first time I played this game, I didn't know like that's what it was trying to set up for. So I did it, and it was just like, oh man. I I would like move one person here or there, and it, it, it just it just didn't work out like like this did. Um, here, where they all get to move in front of the dudes, and then I spend an extra turn, you know, building up audience and stuff. Um, which is pretty cool, I think. You know, I, I think, well, I guess, I guess it was pretty dumb that I did that, but it's pretty cool that this is happening the way that it's happening. I like that. Because now I get to, like, murder them all. And check it out, we totally are just skyrocketing in our ratings right now. Y'all, I don't mean to date this video, but they just released information about Sun and Moon, like the starters and the legendaries and the box art, and oh my god, I'm so fucking excited for that game. Cut! Another perfect scene. Be glad I'm here to tell you what to do all the time. I can't... I keep giving him that voice. That's just, like, the way I'm feeling right now, I guess. Oh boy. Now show the audience some more teamwork! You know how it works. Attack a minion when someone is using teamwork next to it. I trust you guys won't hurt me. <laughs> so you are going to go here. And you are going to teamwork. And you are going to go over here. And you're going to teamwork. Hold on, I need you. You're going to go over here. No! Fuck! I messed up. I don't even care anymore. Like, I was gonna do this, like, triple attack that I figured out you could do, and it was gonna be cool, but I fucked it up. Yay! Great job! Keep it like that! I'm loving this move now! So the boss can teleport in! Where's that big girl in the monster suit? Shazam! This is how you're going to do this. Everyone's gonna gather around the Pokémon. They're gonna beat the shit out of the Pokémon. And then we're gonna get out of here. Pretty much what he's saying is just like gather around the monster, everyone hit teamwork, and then you're gonna do a finishing move, which is pretty fucking rad. I wish I wish you guys could have gotten like my genuine reaction from the first video, but like it it's just recording the the recording was fucked up. And it was totally my fault. Because I didn't know how that worked, I didn't do any like test recordings, I was just like, here we're gonna go! Anyways. Shouldn't we fight the monster before the finishing move? This feels rushed. Our audience will enjoy it. I never want to hear you say I want it that way. <clears throat> so I'm gonna go, like, right here. And teamwork. And you're gonna go right here. And teamwork. And you are going to go right here. And teamwork. And you're going to go right here. And teamwork. Everybody's team working! Oh, fuck. I'm glad I didn't fuck it up! Chroma power! <laughs> That's still pretty rad, I love it. Yeah! Defeat boss monster with a finishing move! Alrighty, here we go! Whoa, 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 you are so strong! 
exploded. Now for the grand finale, the huge monster explosion. No! Oh wait, wait, wait. No! This is like my very into it emotion. Check it out, guys. This is ridiculous. Not even a giant robot fight. Hey! The actors just sit in their chairs. We stuntmen do most of the recording. And besides, this is so silly. We always, we always record in the studio. We should go outside, see different places. Come on, people. Our show is not that bad. I'm listening. Why can't we run our very own studio? Oh my, that's just the perfect idea. Count me in. What, are you leaving Super Rangers? I'm in too, let's do this. Dudes, this is gonna be awesome. Have fun leading a studio that isn't fun to work at, Dr. Mio! Bye bye That's, that's straight up like the Markiplier bye. Like, bye bye Oh, please stop being so mean to your employees. Like, no one fucking deserves that shit. You can't! We just walk out. Like, fuck you. <laughs> that was mean. I shouldn't have said that. At least leave the suits at the door. These stuntmen met a moment later. The, these. The stuntmen met a moment later, still dressed in their old studio spandex suits. They talked about how they could start their own studio and record their first episode. After a few minutes, an idea popped up. My uncle has a warehouse not far from here. We could use it. All right! That could be a start. It might be just what we need. I think you're just what I needed! Let's go there now. I think you're just what I needed! I don't know enough of that song. All I want is to get next to you! You turn me over and take a look at me! What can I do? All I want is to be next to you! I think that's how it goes. It's been a while since I've heard that song. Arriving at the warehouse, everyone got excited because of its size. I'm just missing words all over the place. And how they could take advantage of the available space. They were looking around and thinking about camera positions. Would you guys, like, want to see me play Shovel Knight? I've never actually played Shovel Knight, like, anywhere close to all the way through. I've seen it played when someone spotted something. Because I have it, and I'm thinking, like, wow, I've never actually finished the game. A huge pillar at the very center of the warehouse, covered in some sort of dirty bedsheet. No one knew what was under it. Where are those stunt actors? Oh, there they are. They need to return my studio spandex suits. Wait, what is that? I'll just keep watching. Then, curiosity knocked at someone's door, and the sheet was removed! <coughs> Amazing! An incredible replica- I can't even talk! An incredible replica of device used in an American TV show- uh, Yay! Someone plugged- <laughs> That's what I did. Someone plugged in the energy cable, and the machine sent its welcome message out loud. Yo, what up, bitch? Let me- No, it, it, it's not that. Hello! My name is Cerebro! This is an example message! I, I want to make him sound like Zordon, but I can't really do Zordon's voice, especially with the headphones on because it like throws off the way that everything sounds. Type the words in my back display and I shall text to speech them. Rangers, there's trouble in Angel Grove. Everyone's eyes shine! Wow! Let them have those clothes. I know what I actually want from them now. I'll think of some devious plan. I'm out! Fat guy director out! Once upon a time... We were just looking for a place to set up our studio and record, but... 
Now we also have this Cerebro thing to support our story. It's amazing. Yes, this is it. Just ask... Blah, blah, blah. Just ask your uncle for this, too. Our future fans will love it. Will do. I think he'll be happy to lend us anything, including the warehouse. Hooray! Everyone gather your props at home. Let's meet up tomorrow. We have plenty of work to do. Got a lot of work to do. This game is so cool. Like, like... Like, I'm, I'm not even, like, mad that I'm playing through this, you know, like, a second time. Uh, through the stories and stuff. So the group of friends decided to take a different path in their lives. I'm not even mad about that because it's just, like, this game is so cool. Later that day, the clothes were returned to their old boss. And after a few weeks with a contract ready to be signed. Shazam, it's party! They finally have everything ready to start recording.